bum 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 Oh god! Oh dear. Oh. Oh no. Oh, everything's so loud. Very explosive intro. Oh, that's more like it. Thanks, Racknet. You're nice and quiet. Oh god! Right, now that that's out of the way. We're playing Rise of the Blimming Triad. Oh yes! Okay. Now then, I've beaten this game already, um, I guess on a combination of easy and normal. Because I started on normal, and then like, when I was on chapter 4, I paused the game and noticed it said easy difficulty, so I don't know what was going on there. But yeah, finished the game just today. And uh, I think it's time to play it again already. As him this time, I was playing as... Paradino before, and I'm, I'm just sick of him. This could put a smile on anybody's face. So we're gonna play as Ian Paul Freely, IP Freely, because he's got Paul in his name, and my name is Paul, so it's me. Oh. One year in the future, the UN has proof that a rogue organization known only as the Triad <gasps> has taken over San Nicolas Island. The Triad arising. California. Oh no, not there. The Hunt, High Risk United Nations Task Force. More like hairy to investigate. Underarm. This top secret paramilitary unit has never been called upon. I see boobs. Until now. Brum rum. Plink plink. Oh, clash of the, the Triad titans. has recently claimed responsibility for major terrorist attacks upon several world powers. Oh shit. And the UN has reason to believe they are planning something even bigger. Like a bar. The hunt cases a military installation. Multiple guard towers, electrified fencing, general run of the mill, lights, cigarettes. Yeah, I would say this is their base of operations. Be quiet. Why is it coming out your nose? You're a robot, and you're in the rain. It's causing you to malfunction inside. What's that? It's dropping a bomb on us. Clash. Uh-oh. Tower watch. Focus the light on the lagoon. I thought I saw something. Something. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh my god, it's a boat. Intruders! Enemy boats spotted in the lagoon! Destroy it and open fire on the ridge! Clack, clack! Beep! We've been spotted! Get to cover! Yeah, good idea. Yell to give away your positions. I see a rocket launcher. Uh oh. Bloody hell! Let's take down! Bloody hell! Yeah. Double time and back to the boat. No, it's gonna get blown up, so you shouldn't do that. Maybe if they triple triple timed it back to the boat, they would have died. So it's a good job they only double timed it. Was that the boat? No. no it was a rocket. Uh oh. No. What do you mean remember? Like they always start with one, which they don't. Foos, Roda. Ah oh, yeah. He got exploded like a bob. Remember, I don't want you to die for your country. I want you to make the other poor bastard die for his. Why? Let's move. A hand. Here we have some boss music that we won't be hearing for a while. Anyway, oh yeah, here we go. I really enjoyed this game, for the most part. I hated episode 4, kind of, especially the final boss. I was actually lucky with the final boss, it kind of got stuck. So I could just stand safely and shoot at it. So I don't know how it's going to go on normal difficulty unless it gets stuck again. That'd be nice, but Ah yes. Okay. Well I found a secret already. Yeah, I know all the secrets now I don't actually. Ah Trapezoid. As if I want another pistol now that I've got this. Yeah. 
It's very worthy that this game exists. It makes me happy. I'm not sure what I mean by it's worthy. I don't know. But whatever. Oh, what? How could you mess up the first rocket jump of the... Oh, come on! I've n never have been good at rocket jumping, but oh well, there we go. And I can just... Tasty! Now I haven't got enough rockets to deal with all of you, have I? I don't know, I might do. Hi there. Oops. Yeah. There's another Blonk in there though. My favourite part about this game is the music. Naturally. Music is kind of everything to me when it comes to a game for some reason. I don't know. Well, not everything, no. But the music in this game... Oh! And chew bubblegum. Because he said kick ass. Oh wait. Sorry. Getting ahead of myself here. Yeah, okay, Paul. Good reenactment right there. Maybe you should make your own soundtrack to this game. It would obviously be better. I'm not saying this is bad, I'm just being silly. Why did that happen? I don't know. Anyway, let's have some... No, no, no! Oh! Sorry. I was getting a bit reckless there. Actually, you know what? Hmm. You know what, I'll keep playing on normal for now. I'm just thinking, like, with the checkpoint system that this game has, I don't want to have to keep replaying large sections of the game or having to edit them out of the video when I'm re record re going through it all. So I'm wondering if maybe I should put it down to easy. I mean, it's not that I don't want to play on normal. It's not that I'm too wimpy or anything. There we go. It's just that I don't want this playthrough to have a lot of repetition, you know? I miss quick saves. I mean, yeah, you can you can say quick saves add some more challenge and it prevents save scumming, but, you know, someone who doesn't want to save scum just un unbind the, the quick save button or something. I don't know, that's what I would do anyway. Bob. Explosion. Stupid cars going past outside. Right, let's do this properly this time. Ow! That's far from proper. Oh well. Oh, he's actually doing it. Don't burp. Sorry. <clears throat> Throat gurgle. Ah. That's the only time I really get lag in this game when I'm close to people while using god mode. Ow. <clears throat> also, hopefully I'll be able to show all of the secret levels in this, because uh, after I beat the game I looked up the locations of the secret exits. So like I've probably seen like the start of each secret level, but I've only actually played two myself. I think I played the one of this episode and episode three. Oh yum! Oh yeah. 
why is that platform... That must be a secret of some sort, but I don't know. Ah, uh, I'm very suspicious. Right now. Okay, calm down, the music's good, we know. Oh, what? No, oh, now the door's closed, oh. That's another problem, you can't backtrack in this game after, a cer after certain points. It's a bit annoying, so I wanted to go back and get that bazooka that I passed up. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's alright. Now I've got the flame wall. Which I think was better in the first game, but it's still pretty cool in this one. 